really stands out to me is this R34. Look at this full carbon front here, guys. Look at this front splitter on here is sick. It looks super aggressive. And man, that thing is just awesome, especially with the ARC intercooler down there. So this is Charles Wong. Uh, this is his car, which I don't think I've seen this one in person yet. Big boy AP racing brakes here. Look at these guys, they're freaking awesome. got a sequential transmission in it. V-spec. Look at this rear carbon diffuser. This thing is sick. This FD3 SRX7 is ridiculous. I love the body lines of these things. I really would love to get one someday. Love the front splitter, the canards, everything's super aggressive. It's got a cool aftermarket intercooler, big board Warner turbo kit, DEI heat wrapped, powder coat on the intake manifold, everything's heat wrapped. here too guys cool lugs nice aftermarket mirrors big GT style wing like the wide body kit on there side skirt extensions this is really nice stuff This hood here it's all carbon fiber it has the heat venting here to help the heat, heat escape to help push that air through that uh, heat mount intercooler i love this uh, rear under spoiler here off the uh, deck lid as well as the gt wing looks very aggressive in person look at the titanium um, rear strut bar this thing is sick looking miracle crossbar So these same three Hondas were at the show at Pacific Raceways last week. The Civic Hatchback, you had the CRX, these are both right-hand drive. Uh, this one in the Del Sol, and that's a left-hand drive. It's got a really cool looking 180 here. It's got some Gram Light 57s on there. It's got R33 GTR brakes, it appears. Nice looking car. Cool wing, very stock, very nice looking, very clean build. I like the look of this older 1991s and late 80s Civic hatchback. It's kind of cool. I don't see these very much anymore. It's crazy, look how low this NSX is in perspective to me. Like it is basically just right above my waist, which is just nuts.
how sick these Volk TE37s look on here and like that. It's like an anthracite or like a dark, like charcoal color looks really cool. And I'm pretty sure I saw this this actual car. I'm pretty sure I saw it when I was down at Ours Day in California. Because I remember the BC um, British Columbia license plate on this one, if I remember right. And it had a bunch of like exhaust up the back left from the uh, 2000 mile drive down. guys we've got a spoon honda fit it's got some aftermarket you know wide fenders on the front bulk wheels it's kind of cool seeing something like this in person look at this uh, chevy trailblazer ss it's uh, got a big old giant turbo on it pretty crazy something that you wouldn't expect to see in something like this we're gonna walk around and take a peek but we've got a uh, late 90 Civic I'm not sure if that's a I think that's an EK if I'm right I might be wrong s2000 pretty cool like chameleon paint job on there reminds me of like a midnight purple Civic hatchback another s2000 very clean s2000 look at this thing very nice looking like the aftermarket like titanium cooling panel some carbon uh, intake piping looks very nice got another civic over here with some more custom cooling panels big huge intake snorkel which i haven't seen anything like that since like the 90s i love the wing on this civic look how big this wing is that sticks up here it really has a nice overhang very aggressive looking 